हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज ए स्टोरी बाय अर्नेस्ट हिमिंगवे ओल्ड मैन एट द ब्रिज ओल्ड मैन एट द ब्रिज इज ए टचिंग स्टोरी बाय अर्नेस्ट हिमिंगवे ए वेल नोन नॉवलिस्ट एंड शॉर्ट स्टोरी राइटर He was an American writer. He was awarded the Nobel Prize for Literature in 1954. A Farewell to Arms is one of its most famous novels. This story is a touching story. about individuals displaced by war its background is the spanish civil war which was fought between the republicans who were loyal to the elected leftist government of spain and the spanish fascist who were extreme rightists and wanted to overthrow the government hemingway took part in the war on the side of the republicans the fascists won the war the old man at the bridge is a sensitive story about the refugees displaced by the spanish civil war the opponents were the republicans who backed the elected leftist government of spain and the spanish fascist who were extreme rightists intent on overthrowing the government the fascist ultimately won the old man is the central figure in this story his native place was san carlos he was forced to leave the city he was the last person to leave the city he was advised to do so by the captain because of the artillery he said to the narrator i stayed you see taking care of animals i was the last one to leave san carlos living san carlos made the old man a helpless refugee he was too old to move he had no relatives he did not know where to go he was tired to move any further after he had walked 12 kilometers he had no interest in politics yet he suffered he said i am without politics i am 76 years old i have come 12 kilometers now and i think i can go no farther when he arrived at the place he had very dusty clothes steel rimmed spectacles he looked at the narrator very blankly and tiredly his sole interest in life was a few animals and birds he was anxious about the animals and birds they were two goats and a cat and four pairs of pigeons he could not bring the animals with him his sole worry in life was his animals which he had left behind he believed that the cats could look out for itself he was worried about the other animals the narrator told him that the pigeons would fly away so he should not worry about them this gave him great satisfaction he was told to leave 
worrying about the other animals when the narrator asked him to get up and try to walk but he could not he was very weak to move he was too weak to move his mind was full of thoughts of his animals he had left behind he had not done any harm to anybody and he is suffering without any cause he had no politics yet he suffered he went on repeating the sentence i was only taking care of animals this shows how innocent person suffer during war modern war makes man completely helpless he loses his home and belongings he comes to a place unknown to him he entirely depends on others help in this way people suffered a lot and this fact is revealed from the description made in the story that the people were crossing the pontoon and bridge built on the river by carts and trucks some men women children and the peasants were plodding in the ankle deep dust to cross the bridge the soldiers too have been shown helping to push against the spokes of the mule driven carts to stagger up to the steep bank from the bridge the old man was too tired and weak to walk any further hence he remained sitting there by the side of the road so it is clear that both the civilian as well as the members of the forces suffer much during modern war similarly many civilians and the members of army as well have been killed in the wars fought between iraq and iran india and pakistan at present fighting is taking place in australia and other places so war is very destructive it destroys the human life the system of human life and displaced people so the story is very hard touching story about the refugees who lose their home who lose their houses due to war